There are a couple of ways to wind up with this guy. You could get in line here, or starting today, you can try your hand at fishing. Trout season opens in New York, and you'll have literally millions of opportunities to catch one. Right here at Rome Hatchery, we have about 1.2 million fish um, on an annual basis. Scott and his crew manage the Rome Fish Hatchery south of Delta Lake, where several types of trout are raised. The fertilized eggs first grow into fry, kept here in these raceways, and as they grow, so do the tanks that they live in. A fry stage to a fingerling stage to a, a yearling fish, and it takes about a year and a half to get them to a, to a stock-sized fish, which are about 8 to 10 inches long, um, usually around April 1st. Water for this project flows from both Delta Lake and freshwater springs used at this site for America's first cheese factory. As the fish grow and move to the outside tanks, they're protected from disease and parasites through daily testing and cleaning. The importance of the pathology lab is, I mean, you can look at it in that you have a lot of fish all confined into one place. If we don't nip some sort of disease uh, in the bud, so to speak, right away, they'll it'll become a, more of an epidemic and then all the fish in that particular pond will get sick so we try to uh, um, diagnose things before it gets to be a big problem. The covered raceways also protect them from the ever-present blue herons looking for that happy meal. They'll come in here uh, you'll see 40 or 50 of them at a time and they will eat um, hundreds of thousands of, of fish and once they breach that proper size, the crews with tanker trucks deliver the fish creekside. There are a total of 12 hatcheries statewide, most open to the public and offer a close-up view as the fish start their voyage to one of over 1,200 lakes, streams, ponds, and rivers across New York. Oh, there you go, fish. In Rome, Keith Hunt for News Channel 2.